Are you sick of being on your phone all day? Well, guess what? You can trade your little screen for a big screen and still edit trending audio onto your Instagram Reels. Today, we're gonna show you three ways to download Instagram audio off the app so you can edit your videos on desktop or use it in other apps like TikTok. Well, what if people just don't wanna look at screens at all and they wanna go outside? Outside? They don't wanna go outside, Ryan. They don't want that. No one wants that. No one wants to go outside. Don't talk to me about outside. I'm also gonna show you one secret bonus hack that will keep you from losing a lot of views. So stay tuned and don't let Ryan make you go outside. Hey, I'm Shannon from Hootsuite Social Media Team and this is Hootsuite Labs, where we teach you the science of social media marketing, how it works and how to be successful. With the first method, you're gonna download the reel you want straight to your phone. Warning, we found this doesn't always work with reels longer than 15 seconds, so if your audio is long, skip ahead to method two. Step one, find the reel you wanna use with the song or audio you desire. Hit the share arrow. Tap add story to reel, but don't worry, you won't actually be posting this to your story. Tap the ellipsis and tap save to download the story to your phone's gallery. Share that video from your phone to your computer. Use AirDrop if you have an iPhone or email it to yourself if you have Android. Then use whatever video editing software you've got to pull the audio from the video and use it as you like. If you tried this method, let us know in the comments. The second method, method two, is to use your phone's screen recording capabilities. Step one, get the reel whose audio you wanna steal lined up on your IG, or find your track in the audio library of Instagram. Before you click on the song, pull up your phone's screen recorder. On iPhones, access it by swiping from the top right-hand corner. Let's see an instant replay. Step three, start recording, then click on the audio or the reel you wanna pull your song bite from. Step four, stop recording by pressing the little red icon in the corner. You can find your new recording in your phone's gallery. Upload your screen record to your preferred video editing software and extract the audio from the visual. Then export your audio so you can do whatever you're planning to do with it. I'm gonna assume that's editing the perfect Instagram reel using Adobe Premiere Pro, in which case, as I said before, please stick around for my last tip at the end of this video. If you liked method two better than method one, hit the like button below to cast your vote. The third and final method is to use a third-party app to download Instagram Reels audio for you. This one comes with a use at your own risk warning. We cannot vouch for these apps, but we can vouch for Hootsuite, so snag your free 60-day free trial right here. Step one, grab the Instagram post link, which you can find under the paper airplane icon. Step two, head to your handy dandy internet browser. Step three, search for keywords like download Instagram Reel audio or how to download Instagram Reels audio or even extract Instagram Reels audio. Your results page will have a bunch of options. Step four, choose a site to use. Most of these sites will be pretty similar, so just choose one of the top ones. They all follow the same idea. You paste your post link into the bar and hit download audio. But be careful as advertisers will use cheap tricks to get your clicks, like fake download buttons. Step five, grab your newly extracted Instagram audio from your downloads folder. If third-party software is your jam, subscribe to our channel for more sweet tips from us third-party partiers at Hootsuite headquarters. Here's the spicy bonus tip I promised you at the beginning of this video. Thank you for watching to the end. The thing about trending audio on Instagram and TikTok is that it benefits from a network effect, meaning that the algorithm has to be able to understand that the audio you just extracted is the same as the trending audio that it's pushing out to everyone this week. If it does, it will add your new reel to the audio's page and you'll get all the benefits of that virality and a lot more views. The problem is that usually when you upload a reel that you've edited outside of the app, it gets marked as having original audio and it won't get added to that page. So how do you connect your reel to the trending audio in a way that the algorithm recognizes? Here's what you need to do. Well then, it's hacking time. First, upload your reel. Tap add, tap next. Now, tap the audio at the top of the screen. 
If you tap the controls button, you see you can adjust the volume on your original audio. But if you tap done, you can go ahead and search up the exact same audio. In this case, Nico Fez's sweater. And add it to your reel. Now you'll see two volume bars under controls. You want your original audio to be maxed at 100 and your new name brand audio to be down near the bottom. There's an industry-wide debate about whether or not you should adjust the original audio down to zero or if you should keep it at a few percentages. In our experience, if you adjust the audio down to zero, Instagram will not add your video to the audio page when you post it. So it's best to leave your volume at level six or so. And watch the views start rolling in. <laughs> Whoa. Want more bonus hacks like this? Click the bell to get notified whenever we release a new video. Thanks for watching.